Something else happened here I just wanted to point out. You can see that the underside of the uh, this is the uh, sump. <laughs> but look at that. It's obviously been clouted. You see. Now it may not be a problem that uh, but given the underside of the sump is damp it's possible that they've got a breach there although it looks more likely since it's uh, on the uh, actual oil plug itself as you can see that it's probably just the stopper that's leaking yep yep and also whilst we're here we can see that that guy there this is the oil uh, uh, oh crud this is the oil uh, filter <laughs> and that's leaking too but we've got a leak which seems to be coming out of there <laughs> so I think we'll go around and have a look at the other side to see if there's any other oil leaks although it is just quite possible that all of that is due to the fact that it was leaking out of the head gasket yeah anyway it's unlikely because that's quite a large amount on there I'm thinking probably the filter itself is not been put on properly so in conclusion, right now at this point in time, somebody's obviously tried to bodge this up and get it working, but they've ignored the fact that the radiator's leaking. It's something, sometimes people don't want to do that. They don't want to admit that maybe that's the problem. In actual fact, replacing the radiator is much simpler than doing a head gasket job. So, but I'm not adverse to doing a head gasket job, so I thought I'd do it anyway. Okay, that's it.